my beloved child. In everything you will succeed. I've already promised this and I will make it happen. Why worry when my powerful hand shields, comforts, and protects you? Do not fear, do not be troubled, do not faint, do not be disheartened. The love I have for you is so immense and wonderful that if you could see it with your own eyes, you would jump with joy a thousand times and cry tears of happiness. Please listen to me. Let me speak first. Then you can share your heart. But before we continue, I have great news. Tomorrow, when you wake up, start your day with gratitude for your life and let me put a radiant smile on your face. I want you to begin your day with my words on your lips, singing spiritual songs, praying with the Psalms, and at night, close your eyes feeling thankful for all the blessings and even the challenges you face that day. Rest your head on that pillow that has seen your tears, but now, let joy emerge from your heart, the joy I am instilling within you, turning it into a song of praise. I love you, believe and understand that my love goes beyond your past experiences. I know many have let you down and left you feeling alone. You expected love from them, but instead you faced deceit and saw your hopes trampled. Yet I reached out, lifting you with tenderness. You confessed your mistakes and sins and I forgave you. My forgiveness is forever. I will not change my mind even if you falter again. I will not bring up your past mistakes, for by the power of my blood and my resurrection, the chains that once held you are broken. No addiction, no bad habit, no negative emotion, nor anyone or anything in this world can bind you again. They do not have the strength to undo what I have accomplished. I forgave you, set you free, took away your pain, healed your soul, and covered you with my loyalty. I lifted you with my love, and now your heart is pure and innocent again. You have the soul of a child. I looked at you with kindness even before the world was made. I knew your name, and your destiny was written in my book. Since then, I've waited for your birth to gently guide you on every path you take. I saw with great sadness how some mistreated you, neglecting their duty, failing me when they ridiculed and pushed you aside. Yet, here I am, constant and steadfast. I will never leave you nor forsake you. So I urge you, come to me with all your faith in those moments when you seek me. Ask with confidence, for I know you won't ask for trivial things. I know your heart. Let me tell you I am aware of your thoughts even Here before about. you think them. Get ready for this new life. Accept all the blessings that come your way with moderation and humility. Protect your heart and always remember who provides these blessings. Dedicate this day to me. Seek my presence, prepare your soul, and get ready for joy. I love you. Tell me sincerely that you believe in me. Come to me, take my hand, immerse yourself in my presence and saturate yourself with my word. Give me what I ask of you today. Your humble heart, your eyes seeking my will, and let your steps follow my path. I will show you that your blessings are near. Your soul will rejoice as freedom approaches. You will realize there are things you've cried over that you don't truly need, because you have me. Amen.